There is a new pretty explosive lawsuit that was just filed by a former housewife, uh, Leah McSweeney. Real housewife. Real Not housewife, just, yeah. As opposed to a fake housewife. Right, well, as opposed to just, you know, run-of-the-mill housewife. I thought we could use code here. One of the uh, real housewives. But this has to do with um, Andy Cohen and the housewife franchise, um, whether they in any way pressure people to use various substances, including alcohol and cocaine. Right. Uh, Leah McSweeney is the former Real Housewives of New York castmate who has filed this lawsuit. And Leah McSweeney uh, fans will uh, know that she has battled alcoholism. And she says that being on this show, uh, absolutely, she feels that the producers took advantage of the fact that she was battling alcoholism and actually didn't really um, <laughs> help her in that battle. In fact, it, they made it worse by plying her and the people around her with alcohol. And the, I think the more explosive part of the lawsuit is the fact that she's accusing Andy Cohen of actually doing cocaine with other castmates. Um, and she says in this lawsuit that that leads to a bad environment for people like herself who are uh, you know, dealing with uh, substance abuse issues. So this is what she says in the lawsuit. Cohen intentionally uses cocaine with his employees to further promote a workplace culture that thrives off drug and alcohol abuse, which leads to a failure to accommodate employees who are disabled and attempting to remain substance free. Defendants with the knowledge that Ms. McSweeney struggled with alcohol use disorder colluded with her colleagues to pressure Ms. McSweeney to drink, retaliate against her when she wanted to stay sober. I have to say, I mean, there's a lot there. One is that, you know, if it's true, and I have no idea, but if it were true that he were, you know, he was using cocaine with other employees, can't do that, right? right. You can't do that as a boss, Clearly. period. You cannot do that. You should not do that. I have no idea whether that's true or not. But the other thing in terms of alcohol on the show and all, um, if there was pressure, if there was pressure to do it, especially knowing somebody's right. an alcoholic, that's wrong. But if there wasn't pressure and there was simply alcohol available, that would be like an alcoholic going into a bar. You know what and you're getting saying, into. 